scooby doo So, my name is Philosophical, and I had so much fun making that other video about 10 minutes ago that I'm gonna make another video where I ride the word wave slash word sidewalk here at the Indianapolis airport, and I'm gonna super... <laughs> I'm just gonna laugh at myself and not take myself too seriously. And I love making little YouTube videos because, uh, it's just a small little piece of my little tiny reality tunnel of the crazy universe multiverse that we live in. The Universe, I like to reinterpret that as one universe story. So it's like one big story is the universe. And I just got this baby little spoon, this tiny spoon. But maybe you are really Alice in Wonderland looking at this spoon. And that's why it seems to be shrunken. But it's not really shrunken. But really, I just got a free sample from Cold Stone, and I love free samples because it's free. But everything's actually free if you just live like Scooby D. Whoa, he's taking a picture of that. Cool. I'm taking a picture of him taking a picture of him taking a picture. And it's like picture in a peak picture because we're watching TiVo, and you could pause time if you study the Shipibo, which are the people of Peru who work with sacred plants like ayahuasca which if you have oh the moving walkway is coming to an end please get on to the red the word wave uh <laughs> anywho the shipibo are amazing people from uh south america who work with sacred plants amongst other things they do many things their whole culture but um yeah ayahuasca medicine is powerful it lets you see the seven directions that we're embedded in helps you to balance the male and the feminine and it is just so sacred medicine that I highly recommend researching and there is increasing data coming out and um, anecdotal evidence that it can help to cure cancer it can help to cure addictions it is very powerful medicine anywho we're here at the en route spa pure serenity you can get a massage before you hop on your airplane that's pretty cool you're gonna get a massage? <laughs> I want a moving sidewalk word wave. <laughs> Anywho, I actually got a massage the other day. It was like my one of my first times actually going to a studio. It was my Christmas present for my parents in advance since I'm not gonna be with them for Christmas. And it was really incredible to get an hour long massage. I highly recommend doing that if you, if you can maybe get it as a gift. Um, because it just allows your whole muscular system to relax and I think a lot of people think that get it something like getting a massage is selfish or something like that but that whole concept is really crazy because concepts can turn the concave to convex and simplify the complex I just like how those rhymes words words rhyme anywho because it's like if you treat yourself well then you can treat other people a lot better and then everyone just feels swell because if you treat yourself well then you can treat others well scooby doo i'm just going crazy here riding this word wave thinking about andy goga i just met a girl who did ask me if i do bikram yoga which i did do for a little bit of time because it's that really hot studio but you can't do that every day i think it's better to do that much sweating like once or twice a week because otherwise you might just turn into a geek or a freak. But geeks and freaks are really just the coolest people because as Michael Franti say, all the freaky people make the beauty of the world. All the freaky people make the beauty of the world. And we're all really just unique snowflakes. And the key is to become yourself. You gotta chip away the layers of conformity and uniformity to let your unique true self shine through. Like Randy Land says, scooby do. Please watch all of Randy Lynn's videos. He's like one of the coolest dudes, but we're all really just the coolest dudes if we just become ourselves and stop trying to be somebody else because everybody else is just hanging out on the shelf. Anywho, I'm gonna walk back to my plane because my plane's about to roll out and I do have a bad habit of missing flights and planes and buses and stuff, which my parents make fun of me for because I, I like to live in the present moment and do too much yoga and then I forget about consensual reality <laughs> consensual reality is a cool concept because it's like is there an objective reality or are we all just 
projecting our own reality tunnels into the big reality funnel. Um, so I encourage you to just be awesome because you are awesome. So stop pretending you're not awesome. And that's how I'm going to end this video. But it's all a continuum. So have a fun day and scoobly do. Please check out the links. Please check out the playlist of the videos. Please just do your thing. Peace.